Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're going to check out CCI 44 Magnum slash 44 Special shot loads. Big red shot loads. Big red means that it's actually a number four shot that's loaded up in there opposed to the nine shot that I used last week with the 357 Magnum. Now here is the case right there. And right underneath it says it is for pest control. It does not say for self-defense, but they are big. They, they are loaded with a number four shot, which is much heavier. And that's why it's called Big Red. Now I did this with nine millimeter. I was impressed with the results. I was very much impressed with the 357 Magnum with the blue cap, but here we have my Desert Eagle. Now the reason I have the slide lock back is because it wouldn't charge like it would a normal round. So I've got the load in there right now and I am five feet away with my arm extended from that pesty Diet Coke bottle. So let's go ahead and see what happens. May take a little bath here, not sure, but I love this. And you can see that it is burnt bronze, which is beautiful. It's gonna be a wet burnt bronze very shortly. And yes, it certainly is. No recoil. Let's see if it, yep. But I'm going to be loading these one at a time. I don't currently own a 44 Magnum, but I'm happy to bring out the Desert Eagle with the six inch barrel and just a beast of a handgun with a beast of a load, 44 Magnum. We're going to shoot some pizza boxes. We're gonna check out the iron target and see how well this big red number four shot performs. If that's any indication, it should be pretty good. Let's go ahead and do that. We're going to remain five feet away with my arm extended. Now, that's not a pizza box. I ordered a calzone. And I wanna give you a little advice. Here's a bonus section. When you order a calzone, cheese, pepperoni, yellow pepper, onion, and bacon. Oh my gosh, it actually is going to hurt to shoot this calzone box because that was so delicious. But I've got the Desert Eagle and 44 Magnum ready to go. We're gonna check out the shot spread at five feet. Here we go. Whoa, man. That hits hard. And there goes the case. Let's back up a little bit to 10 feet and see how the 44 Magnum will spread at 10 feet. All right, 10 feet away, extra large pizza. It won't hurt me at all to shoot this because this was a family pizza. And when we order pizza, my wife and daughter, they like mushroom. Mushroom? Daddy likes bacon. But let's go ahead and check out the spread of the shot from 10 feet. Wow. Probably 10 inches, but we're going to get a close up, but let's go ahead and hit that iron target. Five feet away, fresh paint being shot at an angle. Here we go. Man, much like the 9 millimeter and the 357 Magnum, when you hit that steel, it delivers a strong punch. Many people tell me I need to stop drinking Diet Coke. So in support of them and all the people concerned with my health, this is for them. Woo! I'm wet. Here are the final results. Right there's that Diet Coke bottle. Only two or three pellets left in it. Most did exit. There's the steel plate. You can see the spread there. It's pretty identical to the spread with the calzone box. But over here at 10 feet, you can see that, you know, it's right around 10 inches spread from, uh, from 10 feet. So that's the tightest yet from all the ones that I've tested so far with the CCI shot shells, but much more powerful as expected, but it sure is fun to get out here and check it out for ourselves. I hope you had fun, I certainly did. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.